diamonds, no filter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's up, everybody? It's your boy, Doggy Diamonds. Doggy Diamonds No Filter Podcast. I got a special guest with me. Philly in the motherfucking building. All day long. What's up? All the way live from the 2 one fizz out. What part of Philly you from? I'm from West Side. I'm from West Side. So West Philly. No doubt. West Philadelphia. So that's the, the home of my family I was just talking about. Okay. The youngsters. Oh, right. right. Now, I know. I actually, I actually know Taji. Yeah, Taji. And, and I know Karan and yeah. Tariq. Actually, I knew Tariq. Through through somebody that lived on the block on Cedar Ave, you know, okay. little Troy used to live on that block. Shout out to the whole Goodman family, right? The Goodmans, and you know, it's in the city so small, you never know who know who. You know, there was a whole lot of people meeting, <laughs> and the so pops. you don't know who and who families who. But I'm just talking about, you know, I know Taji and uh, Karan. Plus, actually, when we did State Pride, Karan still was doing production, so yeah, yeah, I got yeah, a chance yeah. to get the beat from. Him. Yeah, he did a lot of shit for um, right. a lot of people. So that's that's the homie. I always make sure I shout them out. Philly OGs, Philly legends and shit. No doubt. Steady B2, Steady B, Cool oh, yeah. C. Oh, yeah. No, they, Yo, the they, best. They, 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 they the old, they the old, they the old, they the old, they the old OGs. They young Gs. I'm going to keep it they real. They the old OGs, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I always said on record, my favorite spitters mm. come from Philly. Right. Yo, and low key, the best DJs come from Philly. Well, you know what I learned? You know what I learned? You know, when I got older in the business, is that was the home of the DJ. Y'all didn't even realize it. Yeah. I didn't even realize it. I mean, we got DJ Scratch. I'm happy about that. We got Clark Kent. We got DJ Scratch. But y'all got I met Clint. I know Kent. Y'all got some unfair shit. Y'all got motherfucker. (laughs) Y'all got Jazzy Jeff, the fucking... Right. The Lord and Savior of the turntables. Y'all got Cash Money. Yep. Y'all got Tap Money. Tap money was out there. Uh, it's, it's Frills un- probably know everybody, but it's a lot of a lot of because yeah, he on the circuit. He on, yeah, the, he yeah, on yeah. the DJ circuit. But so I'm yeah. talking about DJs that could do the tricks and all that crazy shit. Jazzy Jeff, come on, man. That's that's all we need. Then I think Jazzy Jeff invented the Transformer scratch. Was it Jazzy Jeff? It was Jazzy Jeff. Probably, probably. Yeah, Jazzy yeah, Jeff. yeah. I mean, he Will he, Smith he too. Etched in stone, so it's like. It Wait, is, was he Fresh Prince or Will Smith? Will Smith was a. Uh, that's his artist. That was the group. Yeah, no, I'm just Will saying. Smith's but what, what, what are we going to call him Fresh Prince today? That's Philly too, man. But yeah, he from Philly. Yeah. He from Philly. He said West Philadelphia, born he and from, raised. Yeah, he from up over Brook section. So yeah, he from West. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. So this is um, Emilio Sparks. For sure. Uh, <laughs> was immortalized in a record called Takeover. What uh, uh what's that? Which one? What takeover record? Jay Z takeover the, the oh, nice right. disc. Oh, the name. I'm take. Uh, yeah, you see, Jay Z think about another one, but the oh, it's far. I get Running it. Right, this rap shit. Right. When you that heard one, that right. line, was right. you like, oh? No, I, I was like, wow, I was on because I was somewhere. I was somewhere like, wow, like I come into the booth, but when you hear it in the streets and people running around rocking, it, it's like, all right, it's a fish. Yeah, you know yeah, I mean? yeah. You sit there, you record it in the studio, and you come in, you like, oh. Rocking, so he pushed it. You right, it wasn't more live. Yo, more live. Yeah, Owen Sparks running this rap shit, crazy. Um, Philly, Philly is a. Uh, uh, is it really the city of brotherly love or brotherly hate? <laughs> well, well, well. We got we got the uh, we got the statue. I mean, you know, we got the, the landmark <laughs> with the love. We got the love landmark. But <laughs> Philly's Philly's Philly, man. I mean, I, Philly's ah, man. What can I say? It's home. What 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 took you so long to do um, interviews and speak out? Cause the whole prop done said something. Majority of the prop done spoke out about something. And you, I seen you on the gram like, damn, it might be time for me to speak. And now you you here finally gonna speak your piece on a few subjects. What right. took you so long? Well, they couldn't find me. Oh shit. Yeah, they couldn't find me. <laughs> yeah, That's yeah, what yeah. happened. So, but no, nah, nah, I saw it. I saw what was going on. But you know, a lot of folks wanted. I just didn't do it. I didn't okay. do a whole lot of interviews touching them kind of situations. I just didn't do it, you know what I'm saying? I curse them out. I tell them to their face, though, you know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, yeah, it's, a yeah. lot of them, it's a lot of things that took place. I don't like, but I, yeah, they know me. You see me in the flesh, you know what I'm saying? The interviews is just I didn't tack on them. At the time, I had other stuff going on. So, But, you know, I guess they covered a lot. And we can talk about, <laughs> they covered we can, let's a lot. Get it, before we take them back, let's bring them forward. Mm-hmm. What's going on right now is Emilio Sparks, The Bad Guy 3. Right. That's, that's available now? Yeah, well, yeah, you can, you can get that. You can, like, inbox me on my social medias and stuff okay. like that. If you out of town, I'll ship it to you, you know, and stuff like that. I just ain't, I ain't put it up on iTunes or nothing. I just pushed it. 
Okay. I just pushed it. So, you know, I I, I wanted to do it later on, but I ain't get a chance around to get to, get to it. But yeah, yeah, I just yeah. pushed it. You could, I could ship it to you. Yeah, yeah. So that's y'all why want I dropped this, it off for y'all. Get you know. this. Um. Right. Also, he has a clothing line. Definitely. What's the name of this? That's Beckma. Being creative kept me alive. So Beckma. That's what that that stands for. It means Beckma. It's pronounced Beckma, and it stands for being creative kept me alive. And that's the line. So that's so that's the, the that's the hat. That's this hats, is the, the shirt. T-shirts. They come in black. They come in white. I got different color hats. You can definitely go to the uh, the web. I'm building a web and everything, so you'll see my web. That's in a uh, preliminary stages right now. So that's so. why you was kind of quiet because you was working. Right, I'm grinding. Yeah, yeah, right, yeah, I'm yeah. letting this speak. I'm trying to let this speak. Not only that, I got a body of work that spoke already. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, definitely. so when I laid back, it's like, where's Sparks? Like, what's going on with Sparks? Like, what's I hear y'all, but he, you know, he was grinding. What's going on? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. I wasn't arrested or nothing. <laughs> I was running around the world. Like, what's up with this? You know what I'm mean? saying? Like, what's up with him? Give it to me, Jay Z record. Was that really your record? Right, right. Everybody know that story. Okay. Yeah. Uh, you know, it's like, I passed that with Jay. It's like Was it the Pharrell Jay, Jay beat you know, and everything? Uh, Pharrell, Pharrell brought the beat once he... he Jay needed a hit. And, okay. And, 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 and a single, not a hit. Okay. A single, and that's yeah. what it was, you know? Okay. And Pharrell did the beat, and with the, the, the you know, with the, the, the hook, the beat, and him, it was, a, it was a hit, so... Yeah. You know, that's what it was. Um... How much publish you get? You got publishing on that? Ah, uh, we talked about this. It's like a lot of things. I get my I get my uh, credit now. My okay. name is on the credit, so I definitely get my credits now. Definitely, okay, for sure. But you actually was in the video. Definitely, yes. I've me. seen you perform it a few times, right? Brother. Chris Rock show, yeah. uh, uh, Saturday Night Live, uh, Vegas, uh, uh, L.A., all the music awards. Uh, uh, where, where else? Uh, tour. Yeah. On tours, I mean everywhere. This was this was this what it was. It was a it was a beast. It was a record that was undeniable that they play to this day. So you know, rest in peace, Rick James. Right, <laughs> well, you know what? Yeah, I, I don't take nothing from Rick James. You yeah, know what? Yeah, rest yeah, in peace yeah. to Rick James. You know, yeah, yeah, I, yeah. I grew up on the music. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, um, state property. Um, from my understanding, y'all all didn't grow up together. No, 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 no. We didn't. Who did you grow up with? Well, me and O, okay. o me and okay. O, like O, I didn't like O grew up in West. He was a different point, but his family was in West. So we, okay. me and O started out together. I, but Freeway was from West too, but he migrated. But me and O was tight, tight, like okay. the tight, tight ones. We was tight. So that was my partner. So I came into business with O, and then okay. I put Crack on. Okay. Yeah. 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 Crack tell a story how he grew up with Freeway. Right. But y'all the ones who pulled them in. Right. Not not, not Freeway. Yeah, right. Because with Petey, I saw him. I remember him. You know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, it's yeah, like, yeah, he, yeah. he stood out. He stood out. I saw all them rap in one group. And he stood out to me and I came back for him. That's all. So, y'all were in the game prior to a lot of the new dudes. But y'all was trying to pull a lot of people in and really put Philly on. Now when I look at Philly, it's so much separatism. Like dudes yeah. ain't really trying to put each other on no more. It's so clicked up. Yeah, it's cl- it's clicks. It's, it's like that's what I stood for. A lot of people okay. like you. Was, I remember before we talked, there like people. Certain people stand for different things. Yeah, man. yeah, yeah. And, yeah. And, 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 and you ain't gotta like you said be a whole lot of rap. You just gotta the way you carry yourself. People understand it. The way you move. The way you you know what I'm saying. The way you operate. It's like all right, I don't move like that. You yeah. know what I'm saying. Like I'm known for making sure people is, is on and taking get that because that's how I built. That's how I built my empires. The, the 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 reciprocated of doing for dudes and then now they might be in a better position and they're not reaching back. Right. Does it bother you? I mean, we it, a lot of that stuff. You know, it, it get under my skin sometimes. Okay. That's that's the theory of it. That's my theory behind what I do. It's like you supposed to kick back. It, like you know, you know what? You know how I mean, you, that rock life familiar. Remember how Dame used to yeah, preach? Yeah, yeah. One man, you know, you strong and this. You if your team you're only strong as the next person. I know this. I come from that too. I, yeah, I'm yeah, a yeah. firm believer in it. Before I got there, so that's why you know I rock, I went so hard for the company. You know what I'm saying? So I'm a firm believer in this. So you know. That was the that was the whole goal behind it. But some folks just don't stand by it. Once they once they get in certain positions and they get in, like you say they get the bag and they they think different, you know. When 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 Rockefeller was the most powerful label at one point, um, one of the most powerful labels. Right. When was it over? Like like because I always like was it a right moment? Here? No no. When when did you realize? Yo, this shit is over, man. Like I think I think once the spoof came out, I think when Death of the Dynasty came okay. out. Okay. It was like, all right, this is borderline, you know. Some real shit, real right? Shit. It's like, they ain't cashing out for nothing, you know what I'm saying? They ain't yeah. pushing this out for nothing. And I, and I wasn't a fool to read that. I could read that. We uh, we switched from different studios and left our home studios and went to different studios. It was like, ah, uh, 
Something ain't right. This internal though, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, but yeah. But you just weren't prepared for for the for the for the for the, for the ship to sink, you know. You just weren't prepared for it. You just weren't prepared because you, you didn't understand. You know, we ain't hit no uh, iceberg. Was it like <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Was it, it was, like, yeah. Was it like parents divorcing and you had to choose who you wanted to be with? But yeah, t- like sim- yeah, actually, yeah, actually, that be honest, yeah. So and where did where did you choose to stay with? I didn't choose. It was just like I had to go with Dame, but Dame never had no part. He didn't have a distribution at the oh, time. Oh shit! You, you know, had Dame, to go with Dame. Yeah, you know, Dame was like, you know, Dame was Dame. He was a real aggressive business dude. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. So. So, you know, that's where I ended up at, and, you know, that's what it was. So, um, at, at, this, at this point right now, when Dame Dash, you go with Dame Dash, uh-huh. and then I think he had the Dame Dash Music Group, and I did think, think they did put Beanie Siegel out, album out, I right? Think, did Beanie put another album out? Yeah, the, be, the, be, the Becoming was out on Dame Dash Music Group, if I'm not mistaken. Actually, that's Tales of Us 2, right? Yeah, because he went to jail. He went to jail right, yeah, and right. he put so, out. Okay, the, yeah. Cool, yeah. So that's, that's like one yeah. of my favorite Beanie albums. So he did get another album out yeah, before yeah, he went yeah. To, Okay, yeah, 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 so he did, yeah. And so, because what I'm trying to get the fans to understand is that you on the powerful label. Right. The label breaks up. Jay-Z goes this way. I think Crack stayed with Jay-Z. Um, PD, PD Free and I think the Young Guns. Yeah, they stayed with Jay-Z. Right. It was PD Freeway and the Young Guns. They and stayed. then y'all go with Dame, but then there is no right. Dame. So yeah. so what does Emilio do from there? Like, like. Like you don't have a record deal no more. Well, Emilio go home. Yeah, <laughs> and take a break. It was a yeah, fresh. Yeah, it was yeah, a breath yeah. of fresh. No, it was just like it was. T- it was. It was a break. You know, I, I felt like I was grinding from from two. I was grinding from ninety nine to two thousand eight. I was in. I was in need of that break. You know what I'm saying? So some things ain't always horrible. As it, it seems to most people. Like for me, it was a good thing. It was a relief. Right. Right. So it's like I, I got. I got to do some independence. Uh, I, I got. I gained some independence. And did some independent uh, things and and pushed and saw uh, seeing things different as a business per, a man and and that's what it was. I got time to go see things and vacate on my own outside the group. I didn't got to worry about who's who and what's why. I ain't had to deal with none of that. I was on my own, standing on my own two feet and pushing. So if Jay Z call you right now and say, "Come fuck with this Rock Nation shit." Well, we, we, I know how to negotiate now too. So I would say, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Sit on this table, right? Yeah, yeah, right, yeah, meet yeah. me at the round table. Like you know, like a lot of that stuff, like a lot of that being raised. Everybody say, uh, everybody asks me if Jay called or what what would happen. You know, it's like like I said, I ain't got time for. I ain't got no bad blood. You know, it is what it is. People that know the story, you know the story. I ain't gonna waste my breath on it. it, it when he ready to talk, he ready to talk. But I don't know if he's gonna call or not. So that's why I'm building what I'm building. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, facts. I, You're not sitting there dormant. I'm not waiting for Jay. I can't, yeah, yeah, you know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah. I'm not waiting for him. So when y'all do do the little spot dates in the shows, how do he get in contact with you? Does this like a random number call you and some for who? For you, like well, when, I, you know what's crazy about that? I'm quite sure him being who he is. If he wanted to find me, he could find me. Yeah, he'll find you I'm right now while we sitting there talking. <laughs> he could, right, if he wanted to find me, he could find right. So so if he wanted to holler, he, you know, he can holler. But in the meanwhile. You know, I got to grind, so yeah. if, if he can find me, then you see I'm grinding. So You know what I'm saying? Y'all did the, the, the B-side show, right? right? Mm-hmm. Um, and you was definitely, y'all, it was like a... a I, didn't, I never made, see, that's, that's another thing. That's another thing. So if you, every, when people talk to me about what they see, why they don't see that Sparks ain't in these, in these arenas with them? They not calling Sparks. So with that being said, I don't get into the bitterness. You know, okay. probably behind closed doors, if somebody bring it up, or I might say... All right, I feel some type of way about it, but it's like oh, I gotta forgive him to a certain extent because I ain't got time to be hey, and I, and he not around me no more. You know, I was emotionally tied to it when I was around him. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, that's the past. You know what I'm saying? It's a history because it's Esther Stone. It was a dynasty that could have went further, way further than or you know, with us, with us. It could have went somewhere, but I'm you know what I'm supposed to do. When when um, it it was in in Rockefeller, y'all took on like a lot of. Opponents, y'all took on Nas, y'all anything, took on anything, anything, anything that came, anything that had something to do with Jay Z, and we felt like it was a threat to him or in the company. It was a done deal. At, at, was at a particular point in your life where you was really ready, ready to lay something down? If was, somebody was, I mean, it, them t- you know, like you said, you from the neighborhoods where yeah, we come yeah, from. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It, it, these type things could take place. You know, one bad argument could turn into a, a serious situation. So you yeah. got you got Siegel and Kiss going at it. Well, that was great stuff, though. You know yeah, no, saying? it was. We we got the great material. Yeah, out of I that. mean, you know, it was, it was it, all. You know, our lifestyle. We come from dangerous lifestyle. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know, so, yeah, so the yeah, music yeah. thing was like you said. That was an out. So yeah, yeah. To put myself on the line for it, it ain't mean nothing at the time. I asked everybody from state property affiliated. When you first heard Ether, where was you? 
at the club. It was ugly because <laughs> <laughs> it was ugly. We was in like Cheetah somewhere. Prime oh, you was time. in the city. Oh, you was in, in the city. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We was in New York, man. It was prime time. No lie, doggy diamond. It was prime time. They burnt it. So we look and we look at home. We like, damn. Oh, bro. you was actually with Jay Z? Yeah, we was at the club chilling. And they yeah. played it in the club while he was there? And they played it. Who was the DJ? Did he didn't get his ass whooped? I, I don't know either. I think soon we walked in, that was the whole purpose of the DJ playing it. Because like, the shit you know starts. Because the shit starts. Fuck Jay Z. So no, you probably it did. Like, it did. <laughs> so we in there, like, it threw us up. But that's why we was. Just, that's why we was like pit bulls. It's like, hold up, get to the studio. This yeah, just yeah, can't yeah, happen yeah, like yeah, this. Yeah, it yeah. can't happen like this. So you know, like that's why I'm saying, like, like with us, it was, it was like, it was, I, that's why I can't really be like all oh, angry. You know what I'm saying? It's like, cause we had moments. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, we yeah, had moments, yeah. and then on business, just business. You know what I'm saying? Business can get crazy. I always want to know. So y'all was in Club Cheetahs, and, and Ether comes on, and y'all all like, what the fuck is going on? Right. Because he attacked them. I said, damn. And then the public was like rooting for him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> they yeah, was yeah, in yeah. Nas' favor. So we like, hold up, man. We can't have this. So, you know, you know, Jay was real laid back with it. But when Hot 972 came up, we was just, you know, it, it was what it was. We was just attacking. Yeah, and y'all went up to Hot 97 <laughs> and flamed Mob Deep. Y'all flamed a lot of people everybody, at the time. Everybody that was uh, our opponents at the time. It was like, everybody that was our opponents. That's what we did. And, and we won. Um... When you did uh, some of the records on a state prop album, mm -hmm. what's your writing process? Because you got an ill style. Like, your shit is, 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 is off, but it's on. Right, right, right. Well, yeah. What, what do you mean, my... Um, my th th like, how do you... Because out of everybody, mm -hmm. you know, you still... I mean, crack, y'all all distinct in your own way. Right, right, right. But you stood out to me because to sing my songs, right, that was my shit. You know right, what I'm saying? Right, right, right. You know, and, and the mama do she want me. Want like, me. I, I just right. like the shit that you, just for some reason, you stood out to me. Yeah. And I was like, Yo, this nigga crazy. You know what I'm saying? Like, the way you put it together <laughs> yeah, was just always, right. yeah, it was right. always style. really, really different to me. You know, you know, you know, the process for that is just to let, you know, with like when you talk about sing my song, it's like what I internalized, you know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? And then I blocked everything out around me because, you know, everybody was in the group doing anything. And a lot of times I was left in the studio all by myself. So what was to do? It's create. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So I go do me, get my swerve on, and I'm in the booth. As long as I got uh, access to the studio, I don't care who's around, what's going on. They on tour, I'm in the studio. You know what I'm saying? If they, they out the club, I might be at the studios. You know what I'm saying? A lot of times you won't catch me there. You'll catch me at the studio. And that's why I had two verses and hooks on a lot of them. Yeah, 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 yeah. So so when Dipset came to the rock, was it inviting or did it get weird? Well, uh, well it was, it, you know why? It, it was it was, it was was another group. Okay. And it was from New York. You know what I'm saying? So it was the like, hometown. It was the yeah. hometown. But, yeah, but, yeah, but, yeah. but Cam had ties out Philly already. You know what I'm saying? So with me, I'm like, it's whatever. You know what I'm saying? But... It's just the, it's just like okay we we know Hov and them and it's like they they gravitated to Dame and it was like a Harlem thing and Hov was from BK you know what I'm saying and we was from Philly so he was we was like his mafia you know what I'm saying so that's just how it was. Did y'all generally get along all right and then it just started getting weird after a while? Not that, well, 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 you know it um it was just cordial, I was cordial because I, I I you know like I said we I'm confident. You know what I'm saying? In any arena. I don't care who's around, what you're doing now. You might know a little bit more than me here, but I come from stuff. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, it's whatever. So it wasn't really weird because actually uh, Jim Jones ended up shooting one of me and old videos, Want Me Back. Facts. So, Facts. so, so, and we shot that with ODB. So them kind of things. It's like Jim was quiet, he didn't say much, but he, you know what I'm saying? I'm quite sure people understand. You know, you know what I'm saying? Like you ain't got to say a lot to some people to understand. What and I was mad at Want Me Back because Usher ended up using that and killing it. Right, Usher went Usher killed, yeah, right, Usher right, killed right, that right, Want Me right. Back shit. It's cool, though, no, because what happened was Want Me Back was uncut. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, yeah, We yeah. wasn't on daytime TV. Yeah, it was like, yeah. all right, we're going to put them on, on evening TV. That was like one of my uncut, favorite joints. And we're going to push this. But it was cool. But Usher, I ain't get mad. I, I ain't get mad. It was like, all right, it was like okay. They, they, for us not to be around him, he was an A-lister. He watching. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He ran with it. So it was like, okay. When you watch... Stuff and you look back now, you got Choke No Joke, got the last days oh, yeah. of the rock. Choke. Shout see, out to the homie Choke. Shout out to Choke No Joke, man. But see, Choke was around, yeah, so yeah, Choke yeah. had the camera at all times. So shout out to Choke, man. It's Choke No Joke. The last joke. days of the rock. Looking <laughs> right. back at it, uh -huh. you like, wow. Nah, you know, it's, 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 it's uh, I cannot say that, man. It's like when you get the mirror back, it's emotional. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It, it, I'll be honest. It, it get emotional because you be like, damn, man, that was some crazy moments. You know what I'm saying? It was just little things that we could have just fixed. 
it was little things that could we could have fixed, you know. Well, it was serious, like it was serious. Like, the little things turned into serious thing, but it was just super little fixed, little kinks that could have just yeah. been done, man. It was just little kinks that could have been fixed, and it was just it was crazy. At, at it, this particular, it's still put it this way: the uh-huh. lady, we still stand as we, it, we ain't here doing no interview. It ain't a mystery why we here. Yeah, facts, facts. It still stand. Yeah, that's it's how forever. strong. That's it's forever. forever. That's yeah. how strong that was. Like you're a part of history. Right. That's how strong that you was. You individually. So, too from the to give it to me. That right. was Jay Z's single. Right, right. You know what I'm saying? Right. It's not just that, man. I shot movies that did millions in theaters. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know what I'm saying? So we, uh, of course, on the music and on and I got a real big bargaining chip in the music business. The state property movie. How fun was that to do? Great. It was my first movie. I ain't gonna hold you, man. I ain't gonna hold you. You know, it was, like I said, it was like. The first movie was crazy, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, we young, we coming from the city, we in big old candles, and we got access to everything. Yeah, man. yeah, It's yeah. like, we got access to the world. Like, we got the keys. And we ain't just had the keys. We was in New York. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. And we was in, was in a, New York, and it was yeah. opening arms. You know what I'm saying? And it was like love. And when we get back, it was love. So it was like, all right, we going through stuff. But it was, it, it balanced itself out. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Um, Right now, at this particular point, um, when we go on the internet, um. We see Oshino, he do he does a lot of interviews. He got a lot of YouTube. Yeah, yeah. He he was going through it with Beans at one point. Right. Was that always him and Beans relationship? Like just with attention? Yeah. With him and o, it, it, you know, it's just egos, you know, it's egos. And then not only that, O O just speak his mind, you know yeah. what I'm saying? It's like, you know, you know, the group is it's like the group is a is a rough group, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. And yeah. we all we all we all, you know, we all feel like we we men and come yeah, from yeah, we come from yeah. The same thing. We come from the mud, so it's just certain things that be getting addressed. And then I guess just he 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 said he fell back for as long time as he could, and then he went public. I, you know what I'm saying? He just went public with it, and then it's, it is what it is. But him being your partner, your person that you grew up with, did you always like lean towards his side more, or do you argue with O and be like, yo, you wild? No, we me and O argue, but yeah, yeah, I don't yeah. public. I don't go okay, public okay. with none of them actually. You know what I mean? Okay. We argue. You know what I'm saying? But but. But I, as far as size, it's like with Matt, like I, I, I ain't gonna front with Ben. Well, oh, I do got a different type of love for him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. To be honest, I do. Mm-hmm. So, you know what I'm saying? That's my partner. Like I said, I came in the game with O. You know what I'm saying? So, so you know, me and we made all made history together. You know, disrespect to Mac, but oh, my boy. So if you ask me a question, that had to be rhetorical or something. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because <laughs> that's my boy. You know what I'm saying? So, well, I guess what I'm asking you is, it, is it a point sometimes where you call him and be like, yo, you wild and old, man? Nah, this- you know what? At this point, at <laughs> yeah, this point, yeah. with, with all the things that took place, I, it's like, I'm just like, is you cool? You know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, 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 yeah. Because it ain't got to be us. You know, Mac, Mac do what he do, too. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mac yeah. say a lot of things on records, and he go public. No, with, he threw y'all away. But, but Yeah, but you know, but Mac do this, and Mac, Mac do this, but he don't say, damn, the, like people writing you, too, Mac. You say nobody wrote you. Yeah, yeah, That yeah. ain't true. You know what I'm saying? So it's like a lot of that stuff we can we can address, you know what I'm saying? But that's why I don't get into it. Cause it, it, it just it's just like, you know what I mean, why? You know, cause when he said I'm looking at it like whatever, this 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 borderline bullshit in my eyes. You know yeah, cause saying? I remember Osino was the only one who responded on record when he was like, I fed and birthed you niggas. Right, right. When when Beanie did that record. Yeah, so he probably they did it that but it was kinda ugly how he did it. Cause yeah. like, Mac, what was this about? We just come from this crazy situation with Rock, you come home from jail, cause snapping on your own team. Yeah. That don't look too cute. Yeah. When when you see O and Meek right now going at it. That's kind of, you know what? That that's wild because you know I I know Meek, you know what I'm mm-hmm. saying? We did the movie Streets together. And uh, we bought Dope movie. ass movie. We, yeah, dope we, ass movie. Yeah, we did we did streets together, you know, and I met him, you know. I even went to one of the apartment buildings, chopped it up, shot a video on the back of their crib and everything. What's up everybody? It's Doggy Diamonds. I created a Patreon account. The Patreon account is Doggy Diamonds No Filter. I created a Patreon account so you can help me on my journey creating this podcast and keeping this content flowing on YouTube. As everybody know, YouTube has been on an ad strike, so it's been really, really rough providing content without getting paid for it. So that's basically what's been happening to a lot of us. So I want to keep the content going, keep the content flowing. I'm not in the ad network. I'm not in a major podcast network or anything like that. I don't have any sponsors. I'm looking for sponsorships. So in the meantime, I'm going to need your help. You could donate a little as a dollar a month. That's only $12 a year. $2 $2 a month, that's only $24 a year to the Patreon account, and I'm going to give you exclusive content that nobody else is going to get to see. Thank you for all your support. The link is in the description box for the Patreon account. Peace. Right. So so, so right now, um, when you see like O 
and um and 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 meek going back and forth. And I guess it's really mm. more old mm. uh saying stuff. Right. But right. the public don't know Meek is really responding. Right, he responds. But he's not responding publicly. Yeah. So it looked like oh, I mean, every time he talk, he yeah. talk about Meek and right. Meek ignoring him, but right. O had to prove that Meek did say something via text about him. Yeah, right, right. Do do you do you look at it like um, Meek should show him a little bit more love and respect because O actually tried to help him at one point. Put it this way. Put it this way. Meek, Meek, you 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 borderline almost where we was at because you know you on that team, but your Live Nation, your your management team. Okay. So this is where we come from. So it's like it's like you know what I'm saying. So when you uh when you when you make these moves, it's like oh we paved the way for you. You know what I'm saying. Yeah, you yeah. in Miami, but New York manage you. Yeah. You know what I'm saying. And we from the city. You know what I'm saying. So you if you know our history and our legacy, you, yeah, like come on, man. Um, and and I think it started over not an uh, Instagram post, right? Probably. I, I don't deal with it. Yeah, yeah, you know yeah, what I'm yeah, saying? yeah, yeah. I don't deal with it at all. So do you just not ask people for shit? So you ain't even got to worry about that's motherfucker how, not that's, doing shit. That's why. That's why I do me. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, Cause, yeah, Because yeah. when certain people reach a certain level, they get snobby, and you ask them for a favor. It's like being around. You got a million, and dude got a, a half a billion. He, you know, his mindset probably think a little different from yours. Yeah, you, yeah. Some yeah. might, some at his level, he probably just feel like he better than the next person. You know what I'm saying? Because it's somebody with more money or got more shine than you. You know what I'm saying? It depends on what you call shine. You know what I'm saying? Cause I was an under the radar dude anyway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm was saying? you ever into all the cars and jewelry and all I, that I, crazy shit? A 15 seater, so I can I can load them up. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. A, a big Lincoln, so I can have. You know what I'm saying? Stinger Lincoln. <laughs> Something to cut, like you know what yeah. I'm saying? Little little basic wheels, so we can get around, look casual. No, ain't nobody painting on me. Stuff like that. Um, right now, um, Philly, it, it is a lot of new um, emerging people out of there. You got um, OBH. Oh, yeah, yeah. They, they, they're busting their moves. They're making noise. Uh, I just, they was at a showcase or something I was supposed yeah. to do. Yeah. You got um, um, Ape Gang. Well, they, yeah, they've been busting their moves. Yeah, yeah. But, I mean, mm-hmm. the internet is just getting a hold of, of these people. They've been in the city doing their thing. They've been pushing. Like, yeah, they, yeah, They've been yeah. pushing on, like, regular. Like, you're talking about the, the social media internet. The, 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 the internet, like, all the websites are yeah, just well, starting to fuck with well, dudes' uh, music. Yeah, people, people riding that wave right now okay. because it's accessible. You know what I'm yeah. saying? People rocking with it. So, yeah. It's like a, it's another tool to push, like, you know. Was you there for Cassidy and Freeway Battle? Uh, did I make it? Nah, nah, nah. I told him he can go. I told him I was done. It didn't make sense to battle. We just burnt 97 down. I, I was drinking Chris Dow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was back at my room sipping Chris. I ain't in front. That, before they, before they, they, you know, they stopped drinking it. <laughs> I was drinking the Chris before they stopped drinking it. Because they said Cassidy <laughs> had the choice of who he wanted to battle. It was freeway. It was free. Yeah, he nah, picked Swiss free. actually called over. Okay. Swiss called over and it was going that whole over about it. And, uh, and uh, they was like, oh, bring your mans over because, you know, Freeway had, the, uh, you know, they was like, he had a long win on it. You know what I'm saying? So bring your man on it. You know what I'm saying? Me, my, my classic joints was different. At that time, they wanted to run with Free. It was a distinctive sound. So they took him on over there, and Cassidy was a battle rapper. You know what I'm saying? So he went over there messing with Cassidy, and that's what happened. And y'all was spent already, though, right? Like, y'all kicked like 900 rounds on Hot 97. We was night, platinum right? when we woke up, so I don't know why yeah. he went over there to yeah. do that. <laughs> you, know, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, no, yeah, I'm just yeah. telling you from my standpoint. Yeah, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, I don't yeah, know how yeah. y'all reading it, but technically yeah. we was platinum when we woke up, man. We was. Yeah, I mean, yeah. mixtapes, we was everywhere off the mixtape. Not, 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 not on register. Not register yeah, yeah, to yeah, the, yeah, num- yeah, the numbers, yeah. but, you know. But it was everywhere. You looking know what I'm back, it's still to this day. Yeah, they looking know me for one of them verses. So it's like looking back at how footage is now. Don't you wish y'all filmed that Hot ninety seven shit? It was. They still got clips. Of but it. I'm talking about like how it looked now. Like it, it, don't you wish you had oh, a cameraman? Oh, it, like no, no, it was it was a little dull. Yeah, yeah, see, yeah, yeah, it, yeah was it was a little, a little dull. dull. Now, yeah. see, the, see the phones and stuff like this. Clear. It's like all right. Let's yeah, 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 all yeah, right. yeah. You could do four K yeah, with the yeah, phone. Yeah, you get your joint on like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. This joint rocking, but yeah, man, definitely, man, definitely. Do you owe any labels, any albums, or anything right now? Do I owe anybody? Yeah, or like, hey, hey, you, hey, you want to tape a little bit of some go live? Are you completely out of um, yeah. frills? Yeah, is we like chill. we let you chill. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. Are, do you owe any? Um, uh, are you still in any paperwork with anybody right now? No, I, I, no, um, I don't owe nobody. Okay. <laughs> I don't owe nobody. I was an earner. <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> you yeah, know yeah. what I'm saying? That's why I can run around. All right, whatever. No, because you know how they be like, you want to do this, and they be like, 
Yeah, but before you sign over there, you still owe me an album or something like nah, that. No, no, no. I never was in them situations. Okay. Never. never so how come never. you and O just when when everything dissolved? How come you and um, Oshino just didn't? Well, do I tried to get with O recently, but you know O put like nine advertisers out, so I had yeah, to yeah, catch yeah, up yeah, with him. You yeah, know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. O put a bunch of CDs out, and then he was running around. Then I was I got I got busy. Matter of fact, did I run into O? I did run into him, but he had, you know, he had a feature or something. I was working on something. He was working on something. I was trying to catch him. It was just bad timing, man. It, you know, it ain't, it ain't going nowhere. How does it feel, though, <laughs> knowing that it was somebody you used to be around every day and you don't see him no more? Well, oh? Yeah. It, you, you know, uh, you you know, it's, it's crazy you ask that. That's a wild feeling because these guys, you suppose, like, we go through it. Like you said, yeah, we yeah, can publicly yeah. talk about this, but it's like, come on, y'all. But that's why when I run into him, I run into him. Like you said, I, uh, we go through our stuff. I, but I just gave gun out a verse. You know what I'm saying? I gave Neef and them a, uh, I, I gave him a cameo on their video. And uh, uh, I called Free. You know what I'm saying? I try to get him on the phone bus moves. You know what I'm saying? Uh, even Matt. You know what I'm saying? When he going through his stuff, I hit him up. What's up? What's going on? You know what I'm saying? But I I, I place my calls and you know what I'm saying? That's be that. You know? But other than that, it's kind of wild. But I, I deal with it because I got I keep my I keep myself busy. Will it ever be another state property in your opinion? Uh, Y'all coming back together doing another project? I don't know. I, I, me, te well, technically, it's like it's been like too long. You know what I'm saying? A uh, gap, and we we hit the internet, and it'll be popping, and it don't take place. You know what I'm saying? So to me, you know what I'm saying? Not just me, how it looks publicly. You know what I'm saying? Because you know the I, fans I, I, would be like, "Yo, y'all just go sit together in the no, room and do it." No, Is just it make easier like, said than done. Now I think it should be, it should have been at the table all by now. You know okay. what I'm saying? It's long it's long overdue. We should have been at the table. You know what I'm saying? So it's like. It's like wow. It's like, when 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 it like when do you sit down? It's like after a while. It's like all right, it blew over. You but know what the, I'm saying? The, the so BET, that's why I'm positioning myself to be like a businessman. Yeah. The the BET uh, state property BET thing. Oh I, yeah, and that was cool. Yeah. That was cool. You know, we did it. We did. We fuck y'all gonna tease us like that for? We like now, oh shit, the prop you, is back. You know what? That you know what? Boy, you need to. You know. You know what, man? You gotta start adding them. You gotta curse them out like the rest of the people do. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, like yeah. you drawing, you drawing. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like it ain't me. Like, like when you asking me, it ain't me, man. Okay. It's like, it's like spark. If you if you if you really knew me, I always a team player to want to try to keep it together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Because yeah. I feuded with a lot of them. Yeah. But yeah. when I come in, I'm busting my mood at, at, at a calm. I'm keeping this thing put together. You know what I'm saying? I got You know, I'm still keeping that thing m mended. Was the was was the money not right? Wait, which one? As far as like, um, <clears throat> you know, O was saying, um, um, Beans was taking money off of shit. He right, didn't right. Even... Now, there, there was a lot of things going on. You know what I'm saying? It, per, once once people found out what they was worth, is it, attitudes okay. came in. People, you couldn't hold that back no more. And that that, that that that's you know that's true. So, so it's like a lot of this stuff you can't hold back. It's like when you when you catch a, somebody handing a cookie jar, it's it, it's a, you got to get a dress. You're stealing, and when, now we know you're stealing, and that's 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 another thing, man. It's hard to come to the table with, because if if I got to sit at the table and I don't trust one of you, or trust a few, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. it's a, it's it's not going to work anyway. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, it just it is what it is. Um, at at the, at this stage of the game, what's keeping you fucking with this shit though? You ain't. Who, me? Yeah. But I, cause when I kick my feet up and I turn and I turn uh turn oh matter of fact, not even feet, if I look at my phone, I'll be like, hold up, what's going on? Yeah, and yeah, yeah. I'm, if I want something to do, it's just there. And not only that, man, I, I come out and people still know you. It's like I get these questions everywhere, man. It's like, what's up, Sparks? What's going on? We need you out here. It's like, all right. It's like I still got it. So it's like I ain't I'm not over. Yeah, yeah. That's yeah, what keep yeah. me going. It's like it's like that's not over. But but if they if they dragging their feet, then I ain't got a, I ain't, I ain't got time for that. Like I just said, I ain't waiting for this. I'm not waiting. I'm not over. It's on, it's only over if you if you deem yourself over or you allow somebody to tell you it's over. Do, or do convince you that it's over. You was a part of history um, that's forever. Right. Um. What's the pros and cons of that? The, bit, the pros and cons to the business. The pros and cons of being a part of history because at this particular time. Oh, oh, it's good and bad. It comes. Yeah. It has its perks. Yeah. It has its perks and uh. And um, what else? It, it, it has its perks, and it, and it, it borderline, it borderline, and it still borderline leave you with some type of some sort of responsibility. But I try to do, you know, what I'm saying, I try to play my part with it, you know, what I'm saying, because I know I'm almost there, but I ain't perfect, you know, what I'm saying. So it come, it come, it come with some responsibility. So it, it, and that's just not just in your local neighborhoods; it's going worldwide because they watch you, you know, when, what I'm saying. When when it was over, did a lot of people start fronting on you? 
Well, you know the difference because, like, like I said, like I said, when you, when you, when you reaching those peaks, when you reaching those peaks and you and reaching that level in life, uh huh. You know what I'm saying? The things that you're doing, and, and and you and you survive in the game. You know what I'm saying? A lot of folks, they they watching. You know, or they might. You don't know why they mad. All you got to do is, def- all you doing is defending what you you you're defending the, your goal and your honor. You know what I'm saying? So at the end of the day. Once that, when it's all when it's all said and done, the smoke clear. You don't understand it until it's over anyway. You mm-hmm. see this and you see it, but like I said, we come from a place like that, so we understand sucker shit. So you you prepare for it anyway. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. Know what I'm saying, do, cause cause do people look at you and say, "Yo, man, you was around Jay Z, man. You had all they the tried chances. That. They tried that. Yeah, yeah, they yeah. tried it. But see, I had a I had a pillow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know yeah. what I'm saying? That's why I had to keep certain ties. Yeah, Cause yeah. They, you know I had a pillow, and not only that, like I said, I like even with the group to anybody you ever, if anybody that know me. Like mm-hmm. you hear about what happened to me, and you hear about what I go through. Mm-hmm. He asked about Sparks. You probably had some, some whatever, whatever you hear. But he wasn't, a, he wasn't a slime ball. He looked out and he was thorough. You know what I'm saying? So I ain't got bad blood running out here. You know what I'm saying? I, I got enemies, but I ain't got, I got, I got, I got. That's because they got personal issues. You know what I'm saying? But I got more, I got more love than you know than the hate because I was, you know, I played my part amongst people. Is it just your character not to air certain shit out? Yeah, yeah, well, it depends. Uh, you know, if they if they push the right button, you know, you're going, you're going, you're going, you're going, you're going, you're going, you you keep fucking with me, you gonna get it. But yeah. but but some things I just it's 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 it's, it's like it's just like ah, you know what I'm saying? It's like, it, plus why I gotta say it? You know how somebody just said if O said it already, yeah yeah, and, yeah, yeah. and these person said it already, then you already know. Because because so, when you're looking at cause this, is what I wanted from your perspective mm-hmm. when you're looking at. All right, I'm a part of a legendary group, State Property. We represent in all of Philadelphia. Right. Jay-Z, Brooklyn, mm-hmm. New York, Dame Dash, Harlem, New York, Biggs, Harlem, New York. Right, shout out they, to Biggs, shout out yeah, to Biggs. They came from New York City, and we, they hooked up. You know, they did a lot for Philly. Mm-hmm. But now, Beans is shitting on Jay-Z and shitting on Dame. Did you feel like, hold up, that's going to fuck all our shit up with New York. Did you feel like that at one point? Well. When he when he came home, yeah, when he was like, no, nah, when we did the record, how can I run back to the rock? I was like, wow, you know what I'm saying? Because I didn't understand it, you know what I'm saying? They had a better relationship than I did with him, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So what was this about? So it was personal, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying? So it was like I, I I was just trying to let Mac know, like, damn, we still got you, but dog, what's up? You know what I'm saying? We still got you, and ain't just him. A lot of folks felt, folks felt like that, like, hold up, what, what are you doing? You know what I'm saying? It's a lot of folks, cause you know it ain't just me, man. People watching, yeah. People yeah. watch this, like yo, no, like, like what are y'all doing? But I guess Mac had to attack him for whatever reasons, because it's you know it is what it is. That's the Game of Thrones. You Did you feel? Like, but do, but do you think looking at, at the position that Rock La Familia shit, y'all took that shit serious? Like this is my family. I'll die for my family. So right. when the family broke up, was you like? How could the family break up? Right, right. You, you know what? Publicly, I, I I look for I was I was I was trying to get other things done. Like you just okay. said, you know what I mean? Like I, people got all this frontline mush to talk about me. I was behind the scenes worried about the money. <laughs> I was out trying to make my own money. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah, I yeah, thought yeah. that you was like, all right, I ain't gonna do nothing for you, but if you show me you about your then I got you. I went and tried to get that situation like that, went and did it, and I'm looking for it. You know what I'm saying? These are the things that happen behind closed doors that I, I should be addressing. You know what I'm saying? But I don't address. You know what I'm saying? But this is what I was doing. Like, I'm sitting back trying to create the money because I, I knew I was worth it. And I was walking into the right meetings and I was hearing the numbers I was supposed to hear. So now I'm trying to get on the phone, holler, and make moves. So it was like, ah. So I was going through a lot of that. But, you know. Um, you Was was you on Black Friday, too? Uh, what, the management? the management? I had fired a team. I, I had fired the management team. Okay. So, so so y'all all was a part of the same management or no? No, I never was a part of none of their management. Never. Okay. Yeah. So you had your own managers? Yeah, I always hired my own team. So what was was that a a, a class sometimes? Because your management wanted you to do one thing, or like how did that work? Well, they wanted us to be managed by one, one person, the group. They wanted the group to be managed, but you know, once like you say, if people yeah. don't trust you with the money, then yeah, 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 we yeah. got to do us. Um, what was the biggest lesson you could say you learned from Jay Z? Jay, Jay, I, uh, what I learned, man, Jay, I, uh. I learned a lot of things. I ain't. I learned how not to write. I ain't write nothing down. You know what I'm saying? I ain't write nothing. Like you know, I seen him go in there and do that. So that's a, that's a method I picked up that I ran with. I ain't never had to write nothing down. Uh, uh, I watched him handle business. You know what I'm saying? That's how I know how business supposed to roll. You know what I'm saying? A lot of things. And uh, that's that. You know, I mean, keep Dame. your mouth shut and get your money, man. Yeah. What did Dame show you? 
uh, Dame was just a, he, he showed you he was for a team. Like like I see Jay Jay was a business man. I looked at Dame like a leader. You know what I'm saying? Okay. It, it was just like that. You know what I mean? And and, and Dame, you see more Dame fighting for you, and Jay was just like more like you know play the game. Yeah, yeah. Um, looking back right now, if you had to say. I fucked up. I did this. What were some of the mistakes you probably made? With me? Yeah. What I screwed up at? Yeah. I don't know. I probably cussing everybody out. Yeah. yeah, yeah probably yeah. cussing. I don't think. I don't look. I don't got too many regrets, man. At the end of the day, I had a fun. I had. I. I don't look. You know what? I look at my. I don't look. When I look back at the age I was and what I was doing, I don't got a whole lot of regrets because I was doing what I was supposed to have been doing. It was mm-hmm. natural. So and you know what I'm saying. And then one folk uh, one and I say, do you? And yeah. that's what I've done. So don't ask me to do me and then got got issues with me. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So yeah, so yeah. it's like it's like that can't happen. It's like so when I look back, only thing I did wrong is just things that I, don't, I touch on. Like I should have had this covered. There was things I could have covered. So I'd have put a legal team. Okay. Uh, the right legal team from the beginning. I, I definitely would have did that. Okay. Totally different. The first the first thing I would have fixed was the the legal team. I went. In, from the beginning, cause that's what that's the money, you know what I'm saying? And that that's where it's at. Boom, you get it, this what it is, and this is what you live off. You set it up right. And that's the only that's what I regret. It's set up right. So you know, that's that's just the reality of it. So so you were signed as Owen Sparks a group? How was what was your deal like? Yeah, man, Owen's a group. Okay. Our contract was for Owen Sparks to drop an album. Oh, okay. Yeah, but O O got into a pickle and I couldn't do nothing solo. Oh, okay. So I had to, I was I was just like, all right, well, I'm not refused to be shelf, so I'm dropping records, I'm leaking records, and I'm on the biggest hit in the, in the world, Word. and I'm and I'm the co-star of the movie that's selling millions, yeah, and I'm I'm screaming Owen Sparks, and the name's still alive, yeah, and I'm gonna come get this collect this money off the street like I know, as you should. Looking back now, you wish you started a clothing line back then. You know what? No, no, because I wasn't ready. I wasn't ready yet. I, now, if the right people was around, like I said, if I was, if you listen, you could take anybody today yeah, and yeah, put yeah. the right people around them, and voila, everything's going to take place. A guy like me, at my, that's how I feel like. At my stature, my talent, and my, or my drive, and my ambition, you put the right stuff around me. It's, I, it's a wrap, even right now. So you know what I'm saying? Even right now, to this very day. So you went from in the street hustling. Huh? To having a record deal, right? What right. was the first the first check you got? How much was it for? Which one? In the general, first, the, first, the first one we had it was it was a four hundred thousand. I mean, oh, had to get the money. It was the first joint. That's you the got sign. split a hundred, or you got we had to split piece. the bean. Okay, we had a hundred thousand. That was our check, and then uh, and then uh, the rest was my pubs and stuff. Like it was like that kind of stuff. It was what, like that. what was what money. was the first shit you bought that you was like, yo, I'm going to buy some a crib. That was the first shit you yeah, got. Yeah, I go and, la- and laced it up. I had to get the bachelor pad. Yeah, yeah, Come yeah. on, bring them on. <laughs> bring them on. <laughs> I, I had so, to go so, get the bachelor so, pad. You know, that's so, only right, so man. So you didn't, you didn't go get the jewelry no, in the car. No, no, yeah, no, yeah, yeah. no. I need Smart a bed. Man. I need a bed, TV, radio. Yeah, yeah, Come yeah. on. What, what R&B record out right now? You ever heard? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I ain't, yeah, I went and got the, got the pad, man. That was just that was smart. That was first and How foremost. How much living man. did you do in Philly, though? Huh? I stayed. I stayed in New York too. Okay. So I, I spent. I spent years in New York. It was. It was. It was uh, I spent years in New York. You know, and then we we stayed in Miami. We we stayed in a few places. We stayed in St. Thomas. We stayed in L.A. Wow. We stayed. We stayed. We so I home home was home. You know, I had a house there, a place there, but I lived in a lot of places. I stayed a lot of places. Not lived, but I was. You know. What's, what's the dumbest shit you bought? The dumbest shit I brought, yeah. I think my, my mini bike. And I, I think that was a gift, but I don't feel like it was dumb because you couldn't tell me it wasn't a motorcycle. Yeah, yeah. I parked that at my parking lot. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I parked that joint on my parking lot. But no, I think the dumbest thing I ever brought was what? What about the dumbest thing I ever brought, man? What's the stupidest thing? I don't think I bought too many dumb things. That was just like the most hilarious thing. You couldn't tell me nothing running through the city with that. I had fun, man. Was you, I had a ball. Was you there for any recording of the Blueprint album? Yeah, yeah, that's the, uh, yeah, the, the blueprint. Yeah, that's Owen Sparks, Free Weezy. Yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah, of yeah. Of course, yeah. What songs uh, did you witness Jay Z record? Uh, uh, which one we was there to, uh, did he do, Bob? Um, we was there for As One. We was all in the building for that. Uh, we did our joint, that joint he did. Uh, ROC, yeah, time out. We got them joints. What else the joint he was I think that's there? Blueprint too. Of course, give yeah. it to me. I was there for yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a given, of course, that. Uh, 
That was a few joints. Do he? Like, when you did get, a lot of his joint was blocked off. Yeah. Like he, so he ain't really let you in like too many of them. So sessions. you you saw him record the Give It To Me vocals? Yeah, yeah. We was there, I was there. Then. Was it really like one tape? What, what what he record? Yeah. Well, yeah, Jay. I guess I guess I watched him. Like me and we kicked it. It was times I drove in the car with him and watched him how he worked. He'd play the music and just be zoning. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, he yeah, don't yeah, say yeah. nothing. He just be zoning, and he just be zoning. The next thing you know, you go somewhere and he lay it down. It's a record. All three verses. All of them. <laughs> He's just sitting there laughing, like listening to the beat and chilling and he get back and you know, and it's it's a rap. And that's one of the things you picked up. Now. Right. He's like, Oh, okay. Yeah, All yeah, right. yeah. You know, cause when you ever write something down, you gotta yeah, keep yeah. looking at it. Yeah, yeah. Like, oh, I keep looking at the joint. Like, but yeah, 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 that that was something I picked up from. So, you know, you pick up some stuff from him. It ain't, it ain't. Was you there when when Freeway recorded his album? Yeah, we was in LA doing that. Okay. So, yeah, we was all out LA with that. Yeah, for sure. Um, so you witnessed what we do. What we was I there for? No, I wasn't there for what we do. I just knew when we came. When I came from out of town, I was in Philly, and when I got there, they was telling about the record that he done, and Jay did a, did a verse to it, and they was gonna shoot the video for it. Yeah, because was that big for Jay Z to actually hop on y'all shit at one point? Right. Like, if he got on it, it was a hot record. Okay. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so that's what that was about. Yeah. What we do is hot, regardless. No, that was a good one. That was a good. That was a good. Record. So how come y'all? I think Philadelphia Free was the best album he ever put out. Yeah, retard. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, I yes. I think that's one of my favorite um, al albums out of the the camp. Right. Besides the um the becoming, that's that's like one of my favorite mm -hmm. joints. Well, both of Beanie first two joints is with well, the the uh the reason the reason, the reason yeah, right, yeah yeah right. yeah that was a good album but I love I love the becoming though my my shit is change gonna come that's my favorite record oh yeah yeah he that's my favorite joints. record he had some joints he had yeah some joints. my favorite record um mm. when when um y'all right now if people want to get state property to do a show how difficult is that. Well, they, I mean, I mean, well, first with me, it's gonna be simple. You know okay. what I'm saying? Because I'm, 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 I'm gonna play my part. I ain't gonna knock them outside the head because I know they gotta call everybody else. You know what I'm saying? So I'm, a, I, so the rest you gotta call them. You just gotta call them up and figure out what they're gonna do. Or they management team. They got, so, you gotta be going through their management team yeah, and stuff yeah, like yeah. that. I like being more accessible. So right I now, know people, how to charge myself. People, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying. So right now, people have to get and through. I don't to you listen to nothing messing with my in the middle of my stuff. Because like, like, I want the world <laughs> to know how do people get in contact with you right now. Now I'm I'm accessible. It's like you can you can uh, my I'm the real Millie Sparks and all that kind of stuff on, on social media. And, stuff and that's like you that. on there. Not no nigga in sweatpants and shit. Yeah, like, yeah, one, yeah. when you see me, it's me. It's like hold on, which one I got on so you know. Yeah, Which yeah, one, yeah. Put that phone uh, for real so I can uh, make sure that... Because there's a lot of Emilio Sparks running around right now. It's oh, it's like three of, Doggy Diamonds. They spelled my shit with a Y a and all types of shit. Sparks is doggy right Diamonds, right one, two, three. I'm like, how you going to just jack my shit? Yeah, so... Like, oh, that see right there, I got the hoodie on. You got me being creative, kept me alive with a hoodie. That's So, you know, that's me with the blue right Okay, so if you got the... Yeah, if you got the yeah, hoodie... If he, that's me. You know, no, that's but you me. know they'll take that picture now, right? Yeah, right, you know, right. Right, because you <laughs> all them views. Yeah, they're like, no, he don't. Not now. I'm glad like, you God, said that. Yeah, I gotta find him. I gotta find. You gotta get. You gotta take. Listen, that's what I'm putting together now. That's a lot of things getting put together. We, um, yeah. I'm revamping right now. I'm putting a lot of stuff together. Right so now. you, so you on also, team. you on Snap also? Uh, Snap definitely. I got Snapchat. The real Mill Spark on Snap. You on Facebook too? Yeah, Millio Sparks on Facebook. I got Fila on. So that's me with the bucket and shoddy. See, he said that. Now they are gonna take that picture uh, and be like, and put this shit on there. Like, yeah, but that's me I with know. the bucket. But uh, but uh, I'm just talking about because you'll go to the wrong page, man. There was one dude page popping more than mine. <laughs> listen, listen. It was a dude had my name yeah. page was popping way more than mine. I'm like, yo, this is crazy. He was bro. getting to it. Yeah, he was getting to it, but I was missing stuff. Messing yeah, with yeah, him. yeah, yeah, yeah. I was yeah, missing yeah. stuff, messing with him, man. Is it ever been a record that you passed on that you wish you didn't pass on? A record that like I a did. beat that was your beat and you was didn't do nothing to it, and then you hear because I heard at Rockefeller, y'all motherfuckers stealing each other beats and shit like that. That rock goes, yeah, you, you, <laughs> you that it, it, like now that happened, that happened. It was a uh, what beat we had? We had supposed to get through. Uh, we had a lot of beat. It was a Kanye beat. I'm mad we ain't finished. I ain't gonna front. It was a Kanye beat that we did, that we had, that we didn't get finished. And I'm like, ah, because at that time, Kanye was just in the camp. Yeah. But he took off. I'm talking about not just as artists, as, produ as a producer, yeah, 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 too. Yeah, yeah, So I was like, wow. You know what I'm saying? I can't front. So I can't front him. Plus, I got chance to, I got time to, uh, chance to bring him to Philly, actually. Wow. So I paid Kanye to come to Philly and all that kind of stuff. So What what what, what type of, did you know he was going to be crazy as a motherfucker out the while? Or like, did you did you see it in him that he was just, that he was like different? So Well, well, you know, yeah, he, he wore sweatpants with shoes, but I didn't know he was crazy. You know, I, no, no, he did. He did, but I just didn't know, I didn't know he was crazy. You know what I mean? Holy shit. He did. 
Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, he did. He Sweatpants, like, 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 like shoes and stuff. Like, you, you'll see him Like with shoes. penny loafers and shit like that? Yeah, like, like shoes. <laughs> like, all right, that's how you ride. Like, all right, that's kind of. Holy so shit. So we had to figure, like, you know, we had to, you know, he was part of the group. So it was like, you know, they signed him. So it was like, yeah, oh, okay, yeah, well, yeah. this is kind of, yeah. When you, first, when you first heard him rap, did you think he was nice or you was like, man, this nigga's kind of. Well, stick I, to doing them beats. But well, I, I didn't hear one of his records until. Uh, Cause Kanye didn't he didn't operate in in New York. He, okay. He wanted to do his record in Cali, so I didn't I didn't hear his record until actually through the wire came up. Oh okay. And then you was like okay. Yeah. Yeah. That record is the one I heard from him. Like what? Uh, yeah, that's the one I heard him on. That yeah. that was out. That he, that he pushed. Yeah. His album was incredible too. That first. No, he had album. a good album. He had. Yeah. I mean, the, he the, the the come out that you know all this did. It was all right. Album. College dropout. That's the name of it, right? Was that college the first? Dropout. Yeah, that college, was, dropout. college dropout. It was. Yeah, right. college that was the dropout. first one. Yeah. But see, when you see him now, somebody that you was around, and now you see them as like some international superstar. Mm-hmm. Did you see that then, or you was? Well, no. Well, Kanye was. He, you know, he was. He he was a uh, different, but he had potential. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, yeah. And he stayed working. You know what I'm saying? So, and then they actually his management team. I seen him. They was grinding. So, like I said, you put the right team around okay. anybody. Okay. So, 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 win. so, what? One of the things that I want y'all to get from what he's saying, team, right. team, team, individuality ain't gonna get you nowhere. When you right. got all the pieces in place, when you got the rooks, the bishops, and the knights, right. and everything right there, that's how you win. You, you you know what I'm can't saying? Lose, can't you still lose. need your pawns too. Right, right, right. And no, and remember, you might be a pawn, but if you make it across, you could turn into any piece. Right. See, a lot of dudes be scared to be pawns. No, no, you know that's that, that pride. That's foolish yeah. pride, man. Yeah, you that's could be a pride. pawn. You make it across, you could turn into whatever you want. Yeah. Except for a queen, you don't want to be no queen anyway. Right, right. You know but what you know what's so funny about that when you say that. What do you think you started off as in the beginning anyway? Exactly. Like, like literally, if you start, if you start even as a child. Yeah, at least unless you blew Ivy. Or something right, right. Like yeah, you <laughs> ruined the power. But yeah, other than yeah, that, yeah. I mean, as, you know, to the money. But even yeah. as a child, if, if if you got parents, you ain't nothing but the porn anyway. Because guess what? They gonna g check you yeah. every time you screw up. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, what do you think you start off as anyway? Anywhere you gonna go, you are gonna be that in the beginning. Then you work your way up. So um. The Sixers, you a Sixer fan? When AI was here, yeah. I mean, I like, I like, I like uh, that young guy. They, 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 the draft, he was cool, but I was a Sixer fan, diehard when AI was here for sure. So, so AI or when AI was in the city. AI or Steph Curry? Steph, no, no, Curry it ain't from Philly. No, I'm talking about we, we saying who's great, who's the greatest? Is nobody greater than AI? You just going with AI? Man, I man, I like Curry, okay. but I, I personally, I know AI personally, so it's I like it. I like him, and then I like the way he balled. I'm gonna give it. I, I'm gonna say I ain't gonna front right now. Russell Westbrook is on some other shit. That kid is no, he good. No. Okay, see, that's that's some. I ain't never seen no shit like Curry that. Curry was awesome. Curry is awesome. But AI is AI. But though. AI, come on. Did you cry when the Lakers beat y'all in the championship? Of keep course, it keep it real. Course. You know what, man. <laughs> like I said, like I said, we come from some some serious things. When when we was popping, the prop and the rock, AI was there too. Cause Philly, so we could go to the all star game. Right, we could go yeah. to the ball game and hit the, hit the club. I'm talking about popping. I tell, the economy jumping. What was the pussy like? Was the pussy some different type that. pussy for you when that time? Well, that, that's different. Like, yeah. <laughs> coochie is uh, forgiving for, for yeah, guys yeah, like yeah, us. Yeah. Like, the coochie is, come on, man. Yeah. He said I just coochie, don't want, so you know Because I don't want the black girls to get mad. You know what I'm saying? Like, They're going to get mad anyway. The, right, the black girl. The, but coochie, come on, man. Yeah, yeah, we yeah. get different. I'm talking about, we, in the, we traveling state to state, yeah. city to city, across. Like, you meeting different cultures and all kinds of stuff. What? So you're trying different stuff out. What was the best weed that you ever had besides um, local? What, like what country, man, I, state? I, L.A., man. I don't know what they put in their weed in California, <laughs> man. I'm serious. No, no, no. The, the, oh, and the Blood Tools was here, too. 1872. Shout out to... Uh, uh, what the hell is his name? And who had the Blood I forget the 187 Blood Tools. Whatever. I forget his name. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now you ain't going to give him up. Yeah, yeah. Because <laughs> yeah. Cali had some, like, some crazy weed, though, before I got there. But it's just... California, man. What artists that you met on your journey that had you starstruck? Michael Jackson. I met Mike and uh, uh, who else I had? Uh, you was at the Summer Jam shit? Of course. Oh, shit. Of course. Mike, I met Mike. Did you stay in there? Because I ain't going to front. If I seen Michael Jackson, I probably would have just stood there in disbelief like a motherfucker. Right, first you do. First you do. Then you realize, like, all right, we got to get ourselves together going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But Mike chilling. Mike come out there say, peace. <laughs> it was on, you know what I mean? 
Yo, we had summer jam. This is yeah, a thug. Yeah, this yeah. a thug crowd. This is a yeah, thug yeah, crowd. Yeah, yeah. Up to my full fledged thug crowd. So Mike, Mike, uh, who else was start? Ain't too many people you meet. Like, I'm, of course, you meet Jay. It's like, are right, we here? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I get Jay's prop, but it was like, it was Mike. Like, Michael Jack, yeah. It was that's... Mike. Like, come on, like, you know, that was Mike. And who else? That's it. Like, I ain't meet too many people that I was. J- oh, oh, Danny Glover was pretty cool. Danny Glover. Yeah, ain't Danny nobody Glo- expected that. Danny Glover that shit. was pretty like, cool. Danny Glover, Lethal Weapon, classic. Yeah, though. Danny Glover was pretty cool. Uh... Who else? That them too. Like Danny Glover was, cause he was chilling. You know, Danny ain't mine. He come on the L stop, kick it with you. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So that was cool. What um? So you was there when 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 Jay Z first tapped Nas with the takeover verse. Like, remember he did the Mob Deep. You was there for the Summer Jam. For the lame. Yeah, 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 yeah. He, him, he we was yeah. there. They was all there, and he attacked Mob Deep and Nas. Yeah, but he yeah. said he ended it with, ask Nas. He don't want it with hold. Yeah. And then he ended yeah, it ended with it. that. Right. And it was over. Yeah. Was the crowd like, what the fuck? Of course. That was crazy. It was crazy. All right. Let me ask you an important question. This is uh, the last Jay-Z question. I That's promise. cool. <laughs> right. It's, yeah. Uh, um, you were somebody who was around him. Mm-hmm. Um, you did fucking a mortal record with him. Right. Um, was signed to him. Mm-hmm. But then you see him make peace with all the enemies. Right. Fat Joe, Nas. Right. right. Uh, and you went at all these dudes for him. Right. How do you feel that some of them dudes might still feel a way about you because you dissed them, all right. but he's cool with them now? Well, you, you know, you know this, this, then that's, yeah, that's a great question, man. I'm faced with this question. every, Even when Freeway went and signed back, you know, I'm faced mm-hmm. with this question. But because it's like, damn, y'all, they signed Jimmy. Yeah, <laughs> you know, they, they didn't even like each other at all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> they signed the Kiss and them. That was Arch Y'all Fibers. went at them. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, Nas nah, signed. They signed all them people. Fat Joe. And I was, yeah, right, right, Fat Joe. That was the first beef. Remember the, the yep. basketball games? And yeah, all that the Rucker Park. Yep. Park. So it was like, ah, it's like, uh, it's like that. With that, it's like, I don't know. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> they probably feel some type of way because it's like, all right, but they went and got their money from them. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, 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 yeah. They went and got paid. So it was like, you know, that's why, I, like, I, I ain't going to go searching for hope. You know what I'm saying? But if, you know, if, if he, you know, he trying to holler, he feel like, damn, you know, I earned mine, like, which I did. You know what I'm saying? So that's what the public need to see. And that was, I'm an earner. Because you actually earned mine. Flamed. I ain't beg him for nothing. He yeah, knew what I, he was doing. You know what I'm saying? When he, he picked me. Yeah. He had picked us. So he, you know what I'm saying? He knew what he was doing. He knew what it was, was, was going to do. So it was like, You need right. one of them choruses again, man. He got it. You know what I'm saying? So it's yeah. like, you already know. So it was like. I, I I look at it like ah that's why I keep grinding you know what yeah, I'm saying yeah, so yeah. when you ask me why I keep grinding it's like man I ain't stopping I ain't stopping because you know that's you can it can make you or break you you know what I'm saying you can sit in somewhere and you can wallow in your fucking misery or you could keep pushing. Being creative kept me alive. That's right. That's the realest shit because um you know at this particular time in all of our lives if we you know they say the idle mind is the devil's playground. Right. And when you standing still, not doing shit, All right? You get killed out here. Yeah, you know right. what I'm saying, or right. kill somebody because oh, it's, yeah. a, it's a then, difference between it's, it's no real difference between getting killed and being buried alive in the system. Like right. some dudes right. is never come, never home. come home. They doing life. So listen, right? With that being said, let's shout out to all the lifers. Yep. Let's shout out to my homie Trap. Like let's shout out to my boy and the Trap. We're gonna free him. And all the lifers and all the people that's on state road and all them folks like that. Because a lot of them make some mistakes they can't fix no more. They can't correct them. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Even if they appeal them and you got life, you just can't correct them. And so, you might have did it as a child. Right, right. And you might have done it young. And you, you know, you just got roofed. Because you, if you be, you know, if you catch the wrong, the, the, the law being passed, you get caught in the mix and you're done. So so just shout out to all those folks that's out there like that. You know what I'm saying? Because I know a lot of them represented me. You know what I'm saying? I mean, they liked, they they rocked with me. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so it's yeah. like, as I had a lot, I had a lot of things going on, but I still had a fan base that was diehard fans, you know what I'm saying? Literally. So how let me ask you about Philly. How everybody, majority of the city is Muslim. Mm. Motherfuckers is violent as a motherfucker. Still <laughs> believing to go to the, the masjid. And the it's a, like, no, no. Like, what the fuck is going <laughs> like, on? No, they know. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> they know. Hold up. No, 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 no. Listen, it's just, you know what it is. You know what it is. You know, you know how I viewed it? It's crazy. It's a humble religion. It is. You know what I'm saying? It's uh-huh. organized. It's organized. But in any in any world, we need, we need, we need, we need, we uh, need, we need you need you need you need you need you need a muscle. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And you need you need brains and you need leg work. 
You know what I'm saying? And, 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 and then you need a, it's a few things. You need muscle and brains. You know what I'm saying? And discipline also. And discipline. So it's like a Because I'm, I'm wild and I'm like, okay, here we go. We got beans. He say he go to the masjid with homie. Homie swing on them and then they go back to the masjid and they make peace. Right, right. What, what, I'm just like, what? The, what? I don't know. It's like, it's like you got to be, I, with that, you got to be held accountable for what they do. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Where I'm coming from. And a lot of, you know, things that was being said. So like, like with that, once you understand the religion, you understand like what they study. And I guess that's what they was tra- talking about in some of them interviews that I, I only got a glimpse of, you know what I'm saying? And they, like you said, they pray together, they bump heads, and they know each other, so that's when, something they had to fix. When the game was attacking um, the young guns, how come y'all didn't pounce on the game like that? Well, 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 at the end of the day, like I said, I wasn't running around with them. Okay. And it was conversations they was having with the game. Oh. And these guys was around all these guys, and I was nowhere near these situations. So when these deals and everything's going down, they're around, I'm not there for them. They don't call me for that, you know what I'm saying? They call me for when I'm bubbling and my fan base popping, or they need me to keep pull the crowd because I got my own crowd, and, and that's what happened. So when game came, it was kind of ugly. But what do I what do I was supposed to do? What and then when Cat Williams is this, right, <laughs> right. I'm just saying, like, like, cause you if you knew me, I was the one that popped off first anyway. Yeah, 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 yeah. I address it quick, but but it's like at the end of the day, what for? Like yeah. I put myself in jeopardy for a situation that ain't got my best interest. I ain't getting no money from that estate. Um, um. Last question: Where could they get the the um the clothing line from? Oh, right now you can get your order on my joints. I gave y'all my uh my social medias right now. I make sure it's in the description. Yeah, because everything. everything else is a preliminary stage as far as building everything, so they can ship it to them, and, and if they need to ship things back and all that stuff like that. But right now they can just go to my social media, and we get it out to y'all. You know what I'm saying? And and, and definitely take take uh, Beckman is definitely uh uh we'll send it out to y'all and get it to you. And so y'all well could get and that, and y'all could get. Bad guy part three. Right, BG3, definitely. Yo, Who, who's on here? I can throw some in there. You know what I'm saying? I can, BG3, you can get that in the same, same way. We actually got a PayPal account for all that kind of stuff. So y'all just send y'all stuff in, email. Yeah, you could give them a package. You could get a shirt, a y'all t-shirt, y'all can, and BG3. J, JJ O Sparks at e, uh, gmail.com too. JJ O Sparks at gmail.com. Y'all can email me also. And now and he just got all mad kind of spam to his shit. They gonna send him his mixtape. They gonna right. send him everything. You right. done fucked up. But on here, the features, I try to get everybody on there, but I only ended up with two features and it was two new artists that I uh that I put on and, and that I uh that I liked the record. I felt like the record was hot. Any videos off this shit? Oh for sure. Uh actually uh the single uh, 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 Ain't Nobody and Hate Me Now. On there. Where could they see those at? Uh, YouTube. I, I, I put them on YouTube. What's your uh, YouTube? You could just YouTube Emilio okay. Sparks. Just YouTube Emilio Sparks and all that thing will come up. But I pushed two videos out on that one. I didn't get a chance to finish the third, but that's what I pushed out on that. Who was a radio just... personality named Emilio Sparks? Did that fuck with you? The radio personality? His What's name you? was Emilio Sparks. You never heard of him before? No, 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 no. Yeah, it's a radio personality named Emilio Sparks. From where? He's from Staten Island. Oh, no, no. I never heard of him. See, I ain't, yeah, that's his <laughs> I name. Ain't is, spell it with an E. Emilio oh, oh, Spock. Oh, all right. Well, good. That yeah. ain't me. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's not me. <laughs> it ain't me. What is Emilio? How you came with that name? Well, if you switch, if you switch the O uh-huh. and put the N there, it's Emilio. I just X uh, the N out and put an O there. It's Emilio. Emilio Spock. See? It's about the million. See? I'm the million, baby. All right. So um, I think we covered anything. Anybody you want to shout out? Let's shout out no, DJ No Frills. Oh, shout out to Frills. Shout out to, shout out to uh, Doggy Diamonds and, and all, of, all the viewers out there. And um, uh, Bakma, being creative, kept me it's, alive. It's, it's one, all last squad. question. Last question. Mm-hmm. Is PSP real? What's Philly support Philly? Yeah, is that real? Ah, you know I want to know because No Frills was PSP for years, but I see some people say PSP, but that's you. Yeah, he started that. He started it. Philly support, but I'm like, I don't, uh, I don't think that PSP shit is. It's kind of wild. It's that when, when my whole thing, my whole thing is is when you say something, had the integrity behind it. Yeah, mean it. You know, don't give me a word and then I, I bank on it. And, you know, it look bad when we rumbling each other and you say Philly with support Philly and nobody. So no some reason. of them, so some of no, you know what? Some of them is supportive. Shout out to GDK too. I got I, I, some of them out there that still reach out to me. You know what I'm saying? So shout out to GDK. And because and, there was a few that was crazy that you know, we, we got a chance to sp- uh, squash. That was a, a few major that was, figures. And, right. So we, that beef, we got a chance to squash that beef. They had beef with every fucking body. Right, right. Well, well, we was on the attack, man. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> we, yeah. We was, on, we was under attack, though. Yeah, yeah. You know yeah. what I'm saying? So when you, when you, when you, when you uh, at that level and you're under attack, it's either fight or flight. And we had to rumble. It was too much at state. You know what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, we won the ring and, 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 
I got ownership in some of it. With that being said, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I got stock in it. <laughs> so they, they I got stock in it. All, all right. right, look. <laughs> they they always the, my fans, my supporters mm. always get at me because I say Ether was corny. They be mad at me when I say Ether is corny because they be uh, saying Ether wasn't corny. Uh, who said you said it was corny? I say Ether was corny. Okay, all right. You ain't like it. You were, you were I just thought the it. shit was whack. Right. You know what I'm saying? I was just more of a takeover though. I right. didn't I just didn't like it. Right. PD disagree, he said Ether was fucking retarded. Right. What the sparks thing? Well, you you know which one I like it's a Uchi Wally Wally, is it five Mike? That was the one. Like, you know what I'm saying? That was the one. It was the second go around that caught me. Super ugly, it, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> the beat ain't do nothing for me in the or the way they orchestrated it. He should have just let us go in there and, and hold it to, and hold it down. You know, they ain't orchestrated right and it was a failure. So what was Ether? Would you Ether was crazy? Ether, they won. He won the battle with that one. But I give it the I was in the camp, so I can't say. Him, you can say it now, I, though, I, right? I yeah. said now I wasn't gonna ride with Nas. Period. At that time, yeah. no matter what I was going through inside, they gonna call me biased. Yeah, cause you from Brooklyn. I just thought Ether was corny though. But but all right, he won the battle. He won. He did, did he win the war though? No, no, because I think we did. did, did uh, did he win? Did he? I don't even. Jay Z signed him after a while. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so I guess he uh, he won. Yo, he signed all his enemies, man. He signed well. He, well, maybe I'm talking about Ether at the time, at the super ugly, but the, it was the buzz. The record, the next record that came dropped, that, that album, Giffin' the Curse, rocked up. All right, that's what Giffin it is. Giffin' the Curse burnt, burnt, burnt the charts down. Yeah, so we here with motherfucking Emilio Sparks. Make sure you get the Bad Guy 3. Right, he has right. it available. Go to his SoundCloud. Right. No, no SoundCloud. No, Go no, to no. his Instagram. Instagram, yeah, you could get and that you could get IG. The, this. Right. And you can get the shirts. Right. So, yo, I want to thank you for coming, man. Thanks Doggy for having me. No filter. Thanks for having me, man. Yeah, and, having me. and look, yeah, we did the interview. He answered a lot of the questions. Please don't come with y'all bullshit right. and try to do the same shit. Just oh, for the interviews. Yeah, right. listen. Shut them down. Don't yeah, ask just the same questions. Fuck question. that. Don't ask the same <laughs> questions. You want to know, just go back to this interview and shit like that. And if you do want to interview him, ask him some shit I ain't asking him. I think I covered a lot of <laughs> shit. You know what I'm saying? But this dude, this dude is just super duper dope. I'm glad the first time he finally got appreciate a chance it. to speak, right. he came through, rock with me, through DJ No Frills, the homie and shit. I met right. Frills. Damn, you hooked me up with Meek back in the days. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? Meek was on house arrest. That was you, right? Uh, yeah, yeah. Meek was on house arrest. And Meek um, wasn't even supposed to be outside. You know what I'm saying? I still uh, got that footage and all that because I came down to Philly. So shout out to you. And what was the other the chick name? Um, uh, Chelly? Chelly? No. Jody, yeah, yeah. Jody and Shelly, yeah. Shout you know, shout out to them for the for the hookup. I don't know if you still rock with them, but you know, they did they 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 looked out and shit. So shout out to Philly. That's the home of the spillers, spitters, the home of the greatest DJs and soul music too, man. Yeah, definitely. Because you got Neo coming, not Neo uh uh music. music. Don't sleep on us. You got Jill Scott. That's another thing, man. Philly. Yo, I, Philly I wanna had get Jill Scott pregnant, man. You like Jilly. I Jilly love Jill Scott. Philly. I love Miss J too. I keep Jay, talking about that. Uh, Jay, I love Miss J. Shout out to Miss J. Shout out to I'm shouting out all the underdogs. I had a major crush on Miss J. I'm my shouting whole out all life. the underdogs. You know Dead what I'm saying? Serious. I just did. I got to have whatever. I just had a major crush on Miss J. I'm okay. keeping real with you. I gotta shout the underdogs. Shout out to Miss got J. Eve, damn, y'all got y'all got Eve, Eve out there. She she with the billions now. She yeah, Eve, all the Eve ain't, ain't from Philly. She ain't no from Philly no more. Yeah. She, she's somewhere. <laughs> she in a whole other country. Uh, Eve, Eve, she missed. She missed the draft pick. Eve, yeah. she, she, we lost her to the draft pick. She so, waking so, up on <laughs> continents. Yeah, shit, we lost yeah. Eve to that draft pick. So you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. It is what it is. But you know, she from the city. Yo, you know what's fucked up? Cause Kobe really from y'all town too, man. And he went to the Lakers and, and yeah, yeah, Kobe. Y'all booed him when he came back though. They booed him here. They yeah, booed him yeah, in Philly. Yeah. I mean, my yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. They, right, they booed him in Philly, right. man. Yeah, Shout out to Philly, Philly, man. I gotta go get me a chicken cheesesteak or some shit. Yeah, you like gotta that. get out there. Yeah, I, I don't, don't eat beef, but I, I love Philly, man. I was actually thinking about moving to Philly at one point. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. It's probably cheap as hell out there because right. all the fucking crime and shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, also, right. nah, you know, but it's, it's, it is what it is. Yeah, it's it going, is. it's going, it's going, it's going to develop into something else, and then it's, it's about the money, man. Once you start developing, man, you see things different. You, 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 like coming through toes make you want more. Yeah, yeah, yo, you know and I, and I'm gonna go on record and say my favorite spitter from Philly mm -hmm. is Joey Jahad. 
Oh, the young, yeah, yeah, young, that's young like buck. my favorite. That was like mm-hmm. my favorite dude. I like Joey Jahad, NH, Kaboom. Mm-hmm. Like, I know about all of the, the niggas from Philly that don't really, really get to shine, shine, you know what I'm saying? I, I, so, I, I fuck with a, a, a lot of um, a lot of them. Y'all just gotta increase the peace in Philly, man. I thought we was bad in Brooklyn and shit. Y'all gotta do more yeah. records. The world is waiting for y'all to unite, though. Mm-hmm. I'm telling y'all, yeah, Philly it, unite, you know what it is? Y'all got this shit. It's people. Somebody got to lead by example, man. So it got to start with somebody. That's we why thought I'm, it was gonna happen with the with the beanie jumping on the meat joint. We thought though, we right. really thought it was gonna happen with like one phone call. I'll be there in three hours. We was like, oh shit, right? right. You got state property and dream chasers together. Right. Oh, it's crazy. And then yeah, All right. well, it is. It is. <laughs> on that note, yeah, we, we <laughs> on that note, ah, we, uh, yeah. we gotta go. We gotta go. <laughs> Peace. We gotta go. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs>